In this video, I'm gonna teach you how to fix Rainbow Six Siege crashing on PC. It's a very easy process, so make sure to follow along. For this video, I'm gonna present multiple methods that you can follow along to fix any problems that you might be having attributed to Rainbow Six Siege. I'm gonna cover possible fixes related to the game itself and the Ubisoft Connect launcher. So the first thing to check, and one that I believe is super simple to reproduce, is to verify the integrity of the game files on Steam. So open your library, find Rainbow Six Siege, right click it, go into properties, installed files, and you will find this option, verify these games, files are install installed correctly. Basically what this is going to do is scan all the installation files for Rainbow Six Siege, including the Ubisoft Connect Launcher and the anti-cheat software that they use, and it is going to make sure that all of the files are installed properly and that none of them are corrupted. If it detects that any of the files in your system are corrupted, it is going to install those files again. So if you go over to the Downloads tab for Steam, you will see that Rainbow Six Siege might receive an update. If that is the case, all you have to do is wait until the corrupted files or missing files are re-downloaded and you will be able to run the game again. I believe this is the first step that you should take because this can solve your issue if, like I said, any of the files were corrupted or missing during installation. The next thing to check is to see if your GPU drivers are up to date. If you have an AMD GPU like me, simply open up the AMD software, go into the home screen, and then at the right side you will find driver and software. This is where you can automatically and conveniently check for updates. If any update is detected, go ahead and install it for you to run the game properly. If you have an NVIDIA graphics card, you will be able to do this process automatically on GeForce Experience or manually if you visit their website. The same can be done for AMD, just go over to the AMD website and manually input your graphics card. Now, with this process out of the way, after you verify the integrity of Rainbow Six Siege and you update your graphics driver, something else that you might want to check is to see if the Rainbow Six Siege anti-cheat and the game itself are allowed to the Windows firewall. Of course, this only applies if you are trying to run the game on Windows. It is very important that Rainbow Six Siege and the anti-cheat have access through the Windows firewall. If any of them are being blocked, you might be unable to access the game. So double check to see if it has private or public network allowed here and you will be able to launch the game from anywhere that you want to play. As long as they have the permissions here, you will be good to go for this, this method. One of the last things that you can try to do, if the automatic integrity of the files check here on Steam did not work out, is to do a clean installation manually. So if you are on Windows, open the installed apps category, type Ubisoft and you will be able to uninstall Rainbow Six Siege and the Ubisoft Connect Launcher completely. Afterwards, by visiting the Ubisoft website, you will be able to download Ubisoft Connect fresh and make a clean installation. This process works well because if the automatic Steam verification did not work out, you will be able to perform a clean installation on your own. Besides all of these methods, while there are other steps that you can take to ensure that Rainbow Six Siege works, these will probably fix your issue and they are going to be all of the methods that I'm going to display for this video. I hope I was able to help you on how to fix Rainbow Six Siege crashing on PC. If this video helped you, please be sure to leave a like and subscribe for more easy tips. Thank you for watching.